Senator uh, Ahern. Th thanks, thanks very much, Lasker here. Look, um, first of all, can I welcome the Minister to the Chamber? It's a, it's a very different time we're living in at the moment, and I think this budget reflects, uh, reflects that, um, that space we're in at the moment in terms of the amount of money we're borrowing and investing. But I think it's, it's the right thing we're doing. Um, as was mentioned by, by, by Senator Chambers, it, it seems uh, with the amount of money we're investing um, in this budget, it's almost impossible to be against it, but somehow the opposition have still managed to find a way of being against uh, uh, funding and investing in, in our country. Um, I, want to welcome, I want to welcome particularly uh, the, the four billion in health, um, which is really important. An awful lot of it was flagged beforehand, but, but certainly never before have we seen so much money put into health, and, and for, for obvious reasons this year more than most. And the, the 3.3 billion put into housing and the extension of the, the Help to Buy scheme, which I think is really important for people to, to get a start in life and, and, and um, get on the ladder. Uh, in terms of justice, I want to welcome the, the announcement of 620 new Gardaí uh, coming through in, in 2020. 2021, uh, which increases the fleet to about 14,000, over 14,500, which is which is really important and for, for me in Tipperary, it's, uh, it's where they're going to be trained in Templemore, so, so obviously it's very important. Um, the 23 million uh, extra funding in rural affairs for the projects under Minister Heather Humphrey's department, it's a massive thing for, for, for local communities, small communities, that um, uh, where they get 10,000 or 20,000 for local projects. There was an announcement this Monday um, on, on projects uh, around the country, and it means an awful lot to them. So the extension on that and the, the, the extra funding on that is really important. But if I could just focus uh, some of my time on the announcements for, for businesses and enterprise and trade, because I think you'd agree with me, Minister, that uh, certainly for, for Fine Gael, since we've been in government, we've prioritised businesses and prioritised jobs since we came in in 2011 whether that's the action plan for jobs brought through with Richard Bruton, where, where he, um, he was looking to, to, to have 100,000 extra jobs at the time, which most people didn't believe would happen, but it did and exceeded. Uh, that we as a government have always uh, supported jobs, and yesterday is a prime example of that. Uh, when you look at the VAT rate reduction from 13.5% to 9%, that's huge uh, for businesses. Even in my area, in towns like Care and Cashel, um, that would be predominantly uh, tourist hotspots, Loch Derg up in North Tipperary as well. Uh, this reduction is a massive uh, uh, um, uh, security for them. Uh, the extension of the commercial race holiday uh, is really important. The extension of the employment wage subsidy scheme through to 2021 should it be required. I think that's really important. It shows um, it gives people certainty, gives businesses certainty. And the most important thing uh, is, the, is the new COVID restriction support scheme of up to €5,000 for businesses. I think that's massive uh, for businesses to get, them through, uh, to get them through the next number of months and survive and be thriving again in 2021. Thank you for the time. Thank you very much. Uh, Senator